Hi guys, welcome to our vlog today. I guess today marks the first official vlog of 2021. Yes, we filmed our New Year's Day vlog and then we took a little bit of time off. We're just trying to get back in the grind of life. We're getting back into our homeschool routine. The kids are doing music lessons again. It's been a while for all this stuff, but we're doing it, right? Yep. A lot of you guys have asked about our homeschool routine and how some of that works. So I figured I would share a little bit of that today. Basically what I do is every day I go through all the books and I sort them by kid. And I put them in a pile so everyone has their specific books. And as the kids go through the books, I check them and then I put them back in the cabinet over there because I don't like them to be out all the time, all day long, because I don't want to look like I have a schoolhouse in my actual house. So that's kind of how I do it. And I'll show you guys a little bit more when I'm not holding Owen so you can see a little more how that goes. We found these 180 day of like whatever the subject is that we like a lot. So we do these books. And I also do music theory with my kids as part of their curriculum. So they have that, and then Michael has all these books. He's got some math books. Alyssa's doing Spanish. She has biology. She has some language arts, history, all kinds of good stuff, right? Yeah. <laughs> She's like, ah! I just came into Zach and Chris's room because it's time to do homework. I had to let him know, but Zach wants to show us his pillowcase he got in the mail. I just got it. It's a stitch pillowcase. He earned it using his jar money, so he's worked hard oh, for it. It's so cute. I look at the back. It's really cute. Oh my god. I love it. So on days like today, how it works is one of the kids is taking their guitar or ukulele lesson, and everybody else does their work at the desk like this, and then they switch off, and then partway through, Alyssa and David go to their voice lesson, which is actually done virtually. So they kind of rotate music with school. Are you playing with toys? Yeah. yeah. Owen's the lucky one. He gets to do really fun stuff while everybody else is doing all the work. There's some antics going on back there right now. But you guys might wonder why sometimes we don't film every single day or why we don't have a video every day or whatever. Partly it's just because it's a lot of work keeping up with school for six kids, music lessons, all this stuff. Oh, and constantly climbing on things, <laughs> needing to get saved. <laughs> I love you, Mama. I love you. I love you. I get your eye. <laughs> You're silly. Are you going to get a bite? He's water, he just wants water. He's literally the pickiest in the world. Why are you happy because you didn't have to eat your food? You stinker. <laughs> is everybody working? Yeah. Looks like two of you guys are doing your theory, which is awesome, good. It says to write the notes of the C major scale, good job. Oh, he brought you the water. Now will you eat some mac and cheese? Okay. Yummy. What are you working on? I'm just um, playing the right hand part and um, choosing a chord to go, to go the with left it. Hand. Yeah. yeah, he's harmonizing. Yeah, he's you harmonizing have to play a melody. It to hear it. Yeah. Yep. Make sure it sounds good. We just got a delivery. Sweet. <laughs> he can barely carry it. <laughs> Look at the box. Is that a piano? Yeah. What's really? It's cool, huh? Whoa! Oh my God. I got it because it comes with the thing that helps you teach yourself extra songs. See, it says a piano that can teach you to play. I'm not letting that piano replace real lessons, obviously. I'm still gonna keep teaching the kids piano lessons, but I think it'd be cool to let them have just different ways to experience music. Cool, it's white. Oh. Well, we're missing apparently a cable, so I don't know if we can actually play this piano. <laughs> well, I was just about to say, you guys, sorry we told it you don't on the piano because we're not gonna be able to use it. But you know, sometimes it just takes the mom to find things that are missing. There it is. Okay, we're gonna start it up. That is cool. Okay. <laughs> I know, I love color. No longer a kid's toy. This beautiful rainbow just made it a Christine. 
item. Zach and Chris have had this in their room for a very long time. In fact, this piano right here we've had since they were extremely young. Are we still keeping it? Yes, we're definitely keeping it. In fact, there's this really cute video that I'm gonna try to find and put of you guys singing with that piano because it's just, it's adorable. taking out the trash. This week I'm oh. not missing trash. <laughs> it's like all he ever does is take out the trash, take out the trash. Get out me. Monkey boards. I know. This is my favorite thing when I was a kid to have a keyboard. That is so cool. Nice. I love it. Oh, looks good. It looks so nice. Michael just asked if he could have this piano in his room. And I would say definitely yes. Oh, are you gonna learn some good songs for me? Yeah. I hope so. Is that your favorite song, Owen? That's the one Owen likes. Here, Mom. Did you finish book? Yeah. Music lessons are all over. So now the kids are playing on the trampoline. You guys are good. Lots of good tricks. Whoa. Well, now it's gone from doing flips and having fun to tackling and trashing each other. Do you want to be part of that? <laughs> Smart answer. I have this wishbone. Do you know what to do with it? I'm going to explain it. Okay, I'm going to do this with Michael. This is the wishbone that came from our turkey at Thanksgiving. We let it sit out and dry, so now it's kind of like a crunchy bone, okay? So here's how it works. You pick a side and we each hold the side and we pull it apart and whoever gets the whole part, their wish will come true. Cool. You wanna do it? Yeah. Okay, you can pull with Michael. So which side do you wanna pull? So we're gonna pull it and whoever's side comes apart, they get their wish. Think of your wish first. Did you think of one? Hold on, I gotta think of mine. Okay, I know. Okay, ready, set, go. Oh, we got the bigger side. We get our wish. Did you have a good wish? Yes. Because you had your hand on it. Wait, what's okay. the wish? Well, if you tell your wish, your wish won't come true. Okay, so we have random news for you guys. You probably heard us in our New Year's vlog saying how we wanted to go on a cruise really bad. So we booked a cruise with my best friend. We convinced my parents to go. We were convincing everyone to go actually. And then today we get an email. It says your cruise is canceled. So that stinks. We were kind of excited. I was kind of excited to go somewhere. I guess it was just too good to be I'm true. I'm excited because we're saving money, though. I mean, yeah. Alyssa, how do you feel about it? Oh, I, was, I was super bummed out. I was even going with Ellie. With I know. Best I know. We are going to have such a good time. We'll still do something fun, and hopefully, we can do a cruise later. I don't know when, but at some point in the next year. We'll just hang out and save money. That sounds good to me. We even made these a fabulous cruise ship countdown. Look at that word cruise right there. Oh my gosh. I know. I I and David was already, oh, don't wreck it. He was already putting his colors on the yeah. days. Yeah, we colored our days in. I know. We were excited. They offered us a $600 cruise credit. That's still good. If we like go at a later date, but daddy's we'll like just, acting uh, get like a refund and he just wants a refund. But Alyssa and I, we still want to go. Yeah. We should just book it anyway. Maybe, I think we should try to go, you know, June. $600 credit. Someone's yes. Pay the bill. But, but then it's again, new, it's a new cruise ship also. I think, oh yeah, it was a brand new cruise ship. We we're so excited. I had like a ride on shop. It'll still be new so cool. Too. That's true, because no one will be cruising. <laughs> so it'll still be new. You guys, thumbs up if you want Matt to let us go on a cruise. <laughs> we're about to answer some questions from you guys. But first of all, the first question, I need you to change your username to Family Fun Pack. But we're still gonna answer your question because we know you're deep down super awesome and you're about to change your username. So, their first question is, do you guys have any phobias or fears? What are phobias? If you're scared of something. Fire. Oh, Alyssa? Fire. Fire. Alyssa's scared of not going on a Okay, that's good. Fire. Natural that's disasters. That's what I worry about. Yes. I yeah. I think it's scared probably of okay. They also wanted to know if we drink alcohol. The answer is no, we do not drink alcohol. The next question is if you had to eat one food for the rest of your entire life. Salmon, salmon, 
<laughs> what would it be? Banana okay, bread, orange banana chicken, bread. banana bread, salmon. What's yours? Banana bread is a good one. Pepperoni pizza. So anything good but healthy, Michael? What would you eat? Perfect. The kids don't want to stop doing questions, so we're gonna do one more. This one is: Do you have a favorite stuffed animal? And if so, what did you name it? Well, I like. All mine are probably named Buddy. My and you can see them because they're all my favorites. All the lions. And yes. My favorite and is all my stitch animals, and their names are Stitch. I like my stuffed animals. Okay, Chris, favorite stuffed animal? My favorite one is an owl named Buddy. My favorite stuffed animal is my husky. It's big. What's his name? I also have one named Fantasia. I've named it Coda. Coda. Oh, just like your auntie's dog. That's cute. Uh, uh, my favorite puppy, my boy, is... Oh, that nice puppy. It's Kona. Well, we have a lot of stuffed animals. Bunny and puppy. Yummy. I love them. Well, thanks for watching our vlog today. We hope you guys have a wonderful day. And hopefully it was interesting seeing part of our day today. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.